Hey guys, how's it going? It's Bill Moore. You know, it seems that uh, edible black ants are all the rage right now in hot sauces. If you're watching my reviews, you've probably seen me review a couple of sauces recently that were made with edible black ants. Something very unique and delicious. And I've got a third one for you guys today. Uh, this is from La Pimenteri in uh, Montreal, Canada. And this is uh, from Julian Frechette. This is his Formica Fortis. And that's in Latin, that translates to uh, strong ants. And just check out that beautiful label with that ant. I just really love this label. From La Pimenteri Hot Sauces in Montreal. Now this is a very special hot sauce because this is a joint collaboration that Julian has done with Rafael Martinez of the Mi Corazon food truck. There's a picture of uh, both uh, uh, Julian and Rafael right there. And another picture of uh, Chef Rafael Martinez in his uh, food truck. So just a, a really unique take. Now this also is, um, I believe, the same flavor profile as his special hop hot sauce. I've reviewed that one before. Just love the flavor on that one. But let me go ahead and read what it says here uh, on the website. It says, a fruity sauce with lively aroma of citrus fruits, mangoes, and ants. Have you ever tasted ants before? It is the this is it is the occasion to discover its delicate roasted and acidulated taste, a sauce that will please the most skeptical, awaken the ant eater in you. All right, and let's check out this one, guys. Now check out those ants. Um, they are whole body black ants. You can really see some uh, some big ones in here. Check that out, guys. The whole body of those black ants, if you look really closely. But really nice consistency on this one. It's got the color that you would expect from mangroves and orange pulp and the citrus type uh, hot sauce. All right, well, let's go ahead and get into this one. Let me go ahead and read the uh, ingredients. And we start off with orange pulp, hop infusion, mangoes, IPA, and then in parentheses, barley lime juice, carrots, cider vinegar, scotch bonnet peppers, long finger peppers, shallots, ants, sugar, garlic, ginger, lemon zest, spices, salt, and xanthan gum, which is GMO free. All right, that is awesome. So he's got a lot of citrus going on on this one. The orange, uh, the lime juice, and the uh, lemon zest. So he's got a uh, a lot of citrus going on in here, and then with the, the hops, uh, it just makes it very, very special. All right, but just check out those ants, would you? All right, you can really see them in this hot sauce. Okay, let's check out the aroma. Okay, this has really got an awesome aroma. Now, I've said this on a lot of reviews uh, where I'm reviewing a beer that's in hot sauce. I, I'm not really a big beer drinker. I'm not really a fan of IPAs, uh, but I love what beer does to a hot sauce. You definitely get the hoppiness, the bitter hoppiness, the aromatic type hoppiness that's in here from the beer. So it does smell like beer, uh, but you get a nice fruitiness as well that's coming from the mangoes. And uh, boy, there's a nice citrus blast of the, uh, the orange, the lemon, and the lime. It's just amazing. And I think it's really cool that they chose uh, this particular flavor profile uh, to put ants in it because... Um, Number one, you can really see them. Uh, and number two, ants uh, have kind of a, a nice little crunchy, lemony, acidic type flavor to them. And so I think this it really pairs well with this type of fruity, um, citrus type hot sauce. But really awesome aroma. It's got the savory notes as well. It's coming from the, uh, the ginger and the, the garlic that is in here. Uh, just a really awesome aroma. And so it's got the scotch bonnet peppers and the long finger peppers. Yeah, and the shallots as well. So those uh, sweet onions. All right, let's show you what it looks like on a spoon. Let's see if we can get some of them ants to come out. All right. Let's get a spoonful for you guys. Really nice consistency and color. All right, here we go. Mm. Wow. Crunch down on some little ants. Um, this is really good. I really like this special hop hot sauce. Uh, this is really the same thing, but 
it's got those ants in here and I think they're really um, showcases uh, the ants very well and it pairs really well with this type of flavor profile you get the fruitiness you get a really nice citrus blast you get the mangoes you get a little bit of savory notes from garlic and the onions and then you get that little crunchy lemony citrus uh, uh, you know aroma and flavor from those edible ants themselves um, this is really good I love this and it's got a nice little burn to it that's coming from the scotch bonnets but it's not really super super hot um, I think he's got this one at, at um, I see it right maybe three out of five peppers if I'm seeing the colors right on this one but such a delicious sauce if you love beer if you love citrus you love orange, lemon, lime, you like hops, um, maybe you like ants, maybe you don't like ants, maybe you haven't tried ants, well here's a perfect opportunity to, to try it, but uh, really awesome, just look at that, it really, really tastes good. Alright, let me show you what I did with this one guys, but before I do, I think this would be good, they say that it would be really be good on grilled meats, uh, perfect for fish, I totally agree with that, I think it would be awesome on, sh on, on grilled fish, on shrimp on oysters, um, even a summer uh, cocktail or a salad which would be fantastic. But here's a picture of what I did. I love these type of hot sauces um, on eggs in the morning. So I made a uh, grit bowl, grits bowl uh, with uh, scrambled eggs, andouille sausage, bacon, uh, onions and peppers and had that on top of some stone ground grits and then topped it with this hot sauce and that was amazing. Also had three uh, chopped up orange habanero peppers in there as well and it's fantastic. But it's a really great sauce. I think you really get the uh, flavor of the ants coming through and it pairs very well uh, with this uh, citrus hot sauce uh, with the beer. I think it's just a fantastic pairing. So great job on this Julian and uh, Chef Raphael. Fantastic job. This is highly recommended guys. Heat I think I would put um, about of a, a three, a strong three out of ten. It's got it maybe maybe approaching a four out of ten on my one to ten scale, but not not something that's super super hot at all. But just an awesome, awesome flavor on this one. Great job. All right, check this company out, guys. Give them a like uh, on Facebook, and the website is lapimentari.com. Uh, you can translate uh, the language so you can see everything in English. And Julian has a fantastic lineup of hot sauces just really something for everybody it's they're really uh, great sauces of uh, fantastic flavor profiles so make sure you check it out julian thank you so much for sending this and i do appreciate it guys thanks for watching stay tuned for a lot more and until the next time you know what to do enjoy the burn we'll see you guys later